Hello everyone! This is Tail Spinner, and with me today is Agent Chum. And when we left off our game, Agent Chicken had just humiliated some poor hapless beefalo by shaving off their hairs. Slightly maniacal laughter in the background. What was that? I didn't quite catch that. Slightly maniacal laughter. So I thought we'd start things off with a bang and get excitement. I'm terrified! Oh, don't be terrified. I'm just trying to get us some beefalo horns so that we can make hats. Whoops. I don't remember my controls. That's terrible! Are you gonna die? No, no. I've got it now. Better. What direction should my screen be facing? Um, it doesn't matter because you're not on camera. Mm. Well, okay. What okay. I do? Took me a minute there. It's been a while. Um, I did not actually get any Tail beefalo. Spinner, what should I do? Oh, I'm back. I'm back. Um, I see you've got a vest there. I think that we really need to make some drying racks so that we can have some jerky. And then we've got a few other things that we probably want to get accomplished before winter is upon us, which of course uh, will happen before we know it. And that would include getting some bee boxes up as we discussed last time. And oh, by the way, do you know what happened to that tree guard that was hanging around earlier? Did he just wander off somewhere? Oh, he, I, I remember seeing him, like, many, many t days ago. He was someplace. Someplace, okay. Mm, not close, I don't think. Yeah. So, I think bee boxes as soon as it's morning. Um, if you know of a good place nearby for getting a whole bunch of charcoal, i.e. a place where you can burn down a bunch of trees without causing anything we don't want burned to burn. I know that you have some, shall we say, pyromaniacal tendencies. Chickadee dee 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 dee. Yeah, so, so perhaps you can be in charge of getting uh, like a whole bunch of charcoal and then we can make some drying oh, racks Gordon. and also some um, additional crock pots for mini bases that we want to set up in other areas of the map. If, we both build one and don't place it, then we'll have it ready to go if we want to put down a swamp base or a base near a Tail walrus spinner. camp if we find one or... Yes? Well, you see, the size of the swamp, it wasn't very big. Oh, it wasn't a very big swamp? The, I did see another swamp from across the water, which I may try to access. Mm, um, maybe we can do that together a little later. I'm just thinking it would be preferable. Oh, I knew we were going to get a hound attack eventually. It's about time, frankly. Those hounds, um, lazy. Lazy is the only word for it. It's, it's like they're not on payroll or something. And they're having to do this on their own time. Oh, did you make another chest? Yes, I did. Excellent. We really did need another chest. And I see you've done nothing at all with the pigskin you had. Oh, I don't, I'm not sure whether I am going to need to yet. Well, why don't you make yourself a football helmet quick before the hounds get here? Wouldn't hurt. But, but, but. Pig butt. Pig butt. <laughs> okay. I no reason not to. A little bit of extra protection. Because the hounds are coming. And when they come, we, we shall need to be ready. The glomer. Oh, the glomer. Should we go somewhere further away? Should we grab Should torches we? and run out into the night so that they come to us among the beefalo? Uh, um, we don't want to lose the glomer, you're right. You have a torch. a torch? Let's go. I could. Let's go. Let's get out of here before they come. We don't want the glomer. 
to be killed. And if the glomer is near us when the hounds come, it's possible that they could attack. I, I don't think that we're going to have a problem dealing with the hounds, but... Here they are! Oh, they're here? Oh, dear. Okay, so run till day. Or set the forest on fire is the other option. Set the forest on fire and then fight! Fight by forest fire light! Um, how are you doing over there? I'm okay, I guess. Here comes another one. Kill it, kill it! Well, we'll have our charcoal problem solved anyway. Mind that we really do need charcoal. Not that much. Not that the much. Real one with we want maniacal tendencies. <laughs> we want massive, massive amounts of charcoal because we want lots of drying racks and at least two more crock pots. It, uh, what I did was perfectly reasonable. Perfectly reasonable. <sighs> I assure you. And the fire is not going to spread that much. Oh, I shouldn't chop that one yet because that one's still burning. There we go. See? It, it's it's very self-limiting. I really should go get my backpack. Me too. See, I've already got enough for one drying rack. This but mine? This can't be mine. What can't be yours? My, my backpack. backpack was off um, near the beefalo, I Was think. your backpack empty? Empty? No, goodness no. Maybe, maybe also, it is mine. I guess I did put some stuff in the chest. I, um... How much health do you have? Health? I have 115. So... I'm, I'm in pretty decent shape for health. Well, I was intending to go up and see if I could get into that other swamp. Um, I don't feel like I've got enough food to go with you for that yet, but I would very much like to join you on that journey. Do you have a I, good I'm store of food on you? Um, do I have a good store of food? I, I've got enough food, if necessary. Um, okay, give me a sec, and I will, I will join you. Um, let me just quickly grab my fish sticks, which I need very badly, and put this meat in the, um, refrigerator and replant all of our farms, and then I will join you. Um, you want the cobblestone road in the opposite direction, the way it or the same way. The way it does not go to the pig king. Okay, I will be with you in just a moment. And then, right before the grasslands, you take the road off. What do and you mean? That, and that will put you in a swamp. I, I'm not sure what you mean. Right before the okay, grasslands. Look, uh, Here, look. I'm looking at my map. Both. Okay, so I need to go this way, and then uh, up this way, and then where? Wait, which way leads to the pig king? This okay, way yeah. leads to the pig king. So go, go along that way, and eventually the cobblestone road will reach grasslands, and when that happens, um, for my, for my screen, it'd be go right. I'm not sure what it would be on your screen, unfortunately. Um, can you give it to me in terms of the grassland? I mean... Here, let me look at the map again. Well, I, I, well, toward well, the graveyard or away from the graveyard? Wait, towards or away from the graveyard? Um, Do I need to keep going on the cobblestone road at this point? I'm in a little tiny savanna area. I feel like you haven't given me very clear directions. <sighs> yeah, me too. Can you come back and meet me? But that's so far away. Okay. Uh, but this is a preferable swamp. If we're going to have, like, a swamp yeah. base thing. Oh, yes, absolutely. We want a larger swamp if there's a place that we're going to go and hang out. Okay, that's the spot. This is the spot? Do I turn go right? right. Okay. I think. Yeah, right. Hello. So, is there a, a good and an obvious spot? Do we want to have a base just close to the swamp? I'm thinking of a place... Looky! Yes, I see. Merms and tentacles. Keep far enough away that they don't aggro on you. Um, I'm thinking that we set up a little base, like maybe right over here in the beautiful and pleasant beachy foresty 
meadowy, flowery spot near the swamp, but not right okay. in the swamp. And then we can come hang up there when it's winter time and lure deer clops into the swamp or whatever instead of uh, having to deal with, uh, you know, raging deer clops, clops destroying our main base. That, okay, that was what I had in mind. So what I have not done yet is um, build but not place a crock pot or an extra refrigerator or anything that we might want to have at a secondary base. I also do not appear to have a pickaxe on me, which is rather unfortunate. Come on, eat me, you in darn fact, my skittle. entire inventory situation is rather regrettable. But I am going to put a science machine here just to... Well, should I put an alchemy engine here instead so that you can build everything too? Maybe that would be better. I like alchemy. Alchemical chemical experiments. Oh, come on, you silly things. Um, let me eat these. Let me... Drop some tools down, and bzz, bzz. all right. What are you thinking, Wilson? I don't know. What, what are you thinking? F, I mean, for you to attack the mosquito, not the tentacle. Oh dear! Did Wilson misunderstand you? Potter's wheel. That's new since the last time I played this game. Oh, really? I've been making pottery statuary in other worlds for years. Well, you have played more Don't Starve recently than I have. It's been a while since I've played very much. I am going to chop down a tree, I think, if I have enough axe left to do it. I would like to have a chest here. Oh, I had two axes on me. Okay, that works. I'd like to have a chest here at this little base for supplies. Basically, I want to set this up with anything we might need for emergencies. And then I... Um, if we find a... Are you well set up for light? Oh, I'm fine. Hey, what are you doing? I was hoping to find a campfire here. This is a campfire. It's just not a very large campfire. What were it's what? What did you just say? I think these were it's what are you examining? Oh, you're examining the tentacle spot. So basically I make books out of tentacle genitalia. Um, what? Shall I drop these fireflies I'm carrying right here to kind of mark our base spot? Uh, wait. What? Or should I keep them for making a miner's helmet later? Don't. You, you have nine other fireflies. Oh, I should stack them. What an idea. Thank you for pointing that out. The other ones were in my backpack, and I picked those up when I wasn't wearing my backpack. Also, my current dapper top hat. Are you really hungry? Hmm? Have some watermelon. Ah! Ah! No! I don't need this! I can't accept it! I need to take it back! Um, do you have food? Yep! Okay. I have tons of food! Well, please eat your food. It's about to be day, and then we can go explore that swamp a bit. I would love to find a Mac Tusk camp before the onset of winter. That would, that would please me greatly. But I think more important than that is for us to get a whole bunch of drying racks made and get a crock pot at this mini base and get uh, beefalo hats for both of us. And I see no tentacle. Oh, a tentacle spike. Yes, this is what I am hoping for. Oh, yeah, I saw that worms. one, but, but I didn't want the worms to attack me. Yeah, they do tend to be difficult that way. So how much of this swamp have you explored? Fair oh, bit or that not? that swamp? Yeah. None, pretty much. Like, no more than you. Okay. 
Well, I don't know that we need to map it out at the moment. Have you gathered a large quantity of reeds at this point? As much as we would need? Because I'm feeling like we did leave our main base. I have not Less really developed than I'd like it to be. Gathered that many reeds. I'm just going to map out enough of it to... To feel like I have a pretty good idea of the general size and scope. This is a a very large swamp. Of of the typical kind with a road down the middle and lots of tentacles and the one thing I haven't seen in it yet is spiders, which is strange. Usually I've seen swamps are well equipped with spiders. Oh my goodness. Don't let the merms get ya. You didn't answer my question about reeds and how many you'd gathered. Pretty much none. Oh, okay. And there could be no more an inconvenient place for a suspicious dirt pile. Hey, I oh, can't swim Oh, please don't trackers. don't track a koala fin in the swamp. It, it it only leads to tragedy. You've done this enough times to know. What if I want to kill the koala fin like an evil maniacal chicken? Evil maniacal chicken. Do you know how much meat we have rotting in our refrigerator back at base right now? Absolutely none. I used it all. Oh, okay. You turned it all into meaty stews no, or didn't. what? I didn't. Well, I have in but mind to head back there and start working on gathering um, uh, materials for bee boxes, materials for drying racks, all of the things that one needs to thrive and not just survive. And uh, I was foolish, I didn't move quickly enough, and I let myself get hit. I forgot rule number one of swamp exploration. Don't stop moving. I see you up there. Are you going to come back to base with me, or are you going to continue to... Oh, poor little, poor little koala fent. It's gonna get, it's gonna, it's, live. it's gonna aggro on a tentacle and it's gonna die. That always happens when you chase a... It will live. I intend for it to live. And so, it will live. How do you plan to protect it from the aggressive nearby tentacles? Hmm? Using the road. There are no tentacles near the road. Well, not that near the road. And mosquitoes? How will you keep the mosquitoes from stinging it? Oh, no. It can handle a mosquito or two. Okay, remember how I told you that I was going to let you use my top hat when it wore down? And you, I wasn't paying enough attention. I was busy gathering reeds and dodging tentacles. And I didn't take it off before it... Yeah, I'm sorry. I'll make another one. Alas, no. Uh, assuming I do not die here to... Okay, I need to get out of the swamp. No, I'm not going to die. I'm not going to die. I promise. We're all going to die! Um, eventually, yes, mortality is just part of the fate of mankind, and there's no avoiding it. I need to find a safe place. Oh, there it is. Okay. I, to stop and look at my map was what I was about to say so that I can get it's... out of the swamp. Okay, come on. No, why can't I F at you? Use the F, Luke! <laughs> the fight button! You're hilarious. I am short one charcoal for a crock pot. Oh, I'll fix that. Oh, I've already I've already set oh, a tree okay, on fire. Okay, okay, but fine. um I won't the fix other that. thing do you have any stone on you by any chance? Stone? Stone. Nope, left it all on the chest at home. Okay. Because I'm also short um just a wee bit short of what I would need to make a crock pot in terms of stone for making cut stone. It's a nine total, I think, that one needs, and I don't have that quite. I've got in three as well, so we can just band together. All right. What have you done? This poor flower. I burned a flower by accident. It's not the end of the world. It's pretty, but it smells like common lab laborer. Okay. 
If you will give me your stone, I will make us a crock pot so that we can have better food here at our outpost. And I see that you have been busily making... Those grass walls grass are in, walls. Why? in case a deer corpse does happen to come oh, to this okay. base. Giving the deer corpse something to aggro on that isn't us. I, I understand. Yes, and something to aggro on the in stuff in case we can't get his aggro. Yep. Wise, <laughs> wise and experienced player you are. Oh. I do have something to burn besides papyrus. Or reeds, rather. I, I was afraid for a moment there I was going to have to burn reeds, and that would have been bad. What are you burning? I am burning wood. I just It took me a moment to find it in my inventory, okay? And these meatballs are for me, but I hope that you also have some food that you can cook. This backpack isn't fancy enough. I need a fancier backpack. That certainly looks like a fancy backpack. It so, is. you need to remind me next time I'm crafting something that has an alternate skin, remind me so that I can actually remember to craft the alternate skin part, okay? Um, what about a birdcage here, or is that just going to be uh, ending up with a dead bird because we're not here to feed it and it starves? Uh, speaking of dead birds, do we need to get back to base? Um, yes, in the morning. I did want to get a crock pot here. Um, I see that you have a backpack that is empty that you're leaving here. Do you want to put a few uh, survival? Uh, yes, I, yes, yes, I will. A few survival items in it that can't burn, perhaps? I am going to take all of the reeds here. I don't, well, I guess the meat will turn into rot and we don't need it back at the chest. I'm going to leave a bunch of grass and that's all. Um, no, well, I'm going to leave my, I'm going to leave my flint because you never want to be stuck without flint and yeah. Emergency supplies. Emergency all right, we going down now? Yes, I am going to be gathering grass on the way because I left all the grass I had in the chest because I think it's important to have a supply especially you know when summer comes and all the grass withers you need to make sure you're well stocked so we're we're down to like four days i think until winter is truly going to come yeah and we still don't have bee boxes or drying racks or beefalo hats we do have an outpost so that's good that's that's a good thing I also want to start um, paying attention to how much health my pickaxe has. I'm saying this for me, not you. And putting it in my backpack when it reaches 6 or 3% and saving it for a thermal stone. I know that insulated clothing is better, but I'm going to need massive amounts of grass for making dry I'm racks. Gonna, I might do some wormhole hopping. Okay, um, if you can get any more charcoal, I will need massive amounts Please. of charcoal for drying racks too. We're going to be getting a lot of meat from killing beefalo for hats, so we do want to make sure we have the drying racks to accommodate it. Once the nights start getting really long in winter, jerky is going to be helpful. So much to do, so little time. I kind of always feel that way my first my first season. You know what's hilarious is that beefalo that I killed. Hmm. What? It's didn't drop any beefalo horns, which is what I was hoping for, but it dropped beefalo wool, even though you had shaved it. Well, there were still the eyebrows, you know? <laughs> the few, eyebrows. And a, and a few tufts hanging off. <laughs> oh, you poor sad fish. See, I'm, I'm using 
green caps and blue caps as crock pot filler. It's it's kind of sad. What's so sad about it? It's Oh, we got a pumpkin. That is one of the things that I think it's worth saving seeds for. Pumpkin McBumpkin! Sat on a wall! So, pumpkin McBumpkin! Let's do that. And we only got one seed. Oh well. Go ahead and replant that right away. Also, your butterflies are starting to, starting to turn. Yes, librarian needs food. Librarian is making food. One butterfly, one mushroom, one durian, and I might as well put in another mushroom because the they're just gonna rot if I if I don't use them. Put the watermelon in the fridge. Right. Eat the fish sticks. Going down. I have been digested. You've been digested. Goodness, we have very full chests. Oh, come on, I didn't mean to use that third kit. Um, I'm not sure why you have a fishing rod in the chest at all. It seems to me that fishing rods are best stored next to ponds. No? Ah, it's whatever. One butterfly and three mushrooms that are starting to go stale equals a cupcake. Excellent! That's science I'm gonna go for ahead. You. That is science for you. I'm going to go ahead and harvest all of our berry bushes because even if they rot in the fridge, then we'll have lots of rot for making booster shots. And it's evening, which means that we don't have a problem with gobblers and... I said we don't have a problem with gobblers. We're going to want to turn this into a gobbler farm as soon as we have some hound's teeth. Did we get any hound's teeth, by the way? No. Not that I, I know. I'm going to go check that area where we were fighting the hounds. I didn't see any at all. But I also want to harvest any charcoal that's up there. Why, hello, friendly neighborhood tree guard. A green gem? It's so the tree guard still is gemming. around and is still fairly close to our base. I got a green gem, tail spinner. A green gem. What do the green ones do? I have no idea. I've seen blue gems and red gems and purple gems and orange gems. You I've really want to get started with magic, don't you? Have I seen a green gem? I got it in a tumbleweed. In a tumbleweed? Yes, I'm in a desert. That means you found a desert. Didn't I tell you that I'd come up in a desert after I went... <gasps> Wait, no. I'm incorrect. It's so funny. It's not funny. It's hilarious. Your your maniacal laughter is slightly disturbing. Also, the sounds of creeping shadow hands are slightly concerning. How is your sanity, my dear? It's excellent. Really? Excellently bad. Really? Yeah, it's excellently okay. bad. You are aware, I am sure, that we have a good many green mushrooms yep. in a chest at Didn't our base. Didn't bother to bring any, though. Um, why don't you come home, Mr. Jumps into wormholes without any regard for his own sanity? Ridiculous. I don't do that. 
Oh, so you're telling me you had great regard for your sanity when you jumped into those wormholes? Yep. Come on, Day. I want to chop down these trees I've burned. I have been busily working to get us what we need. Oh, I've got a present, but I'm not going to open it right now because I have other things in mind Presents at the moment. Presents are to be opened in the present. Now, where's the dragonfly? Goodness, these trees are taking forever. Ah, there he is. I'll be going this way with the tumbleweeds. Tumbleweed, get back here. Um, we probably should be ending the episode fairly soon. We'd started what? it partway through the day, but I think we are now far enough along that we're going to have a good half hour-ish episode very soon, if not already. Yay, flat sucker's huge! I remember a guide on how to defeat the dragonfly of Wigfred. Unfortunately, I You're not, not Wigfred. Wigfred. And please don't, ah! go, please don't ah! go fighting the dragonfly yet. That is not something we're ready to do right now. Twa, we'll, twa, twa, we'll set up a hound's twa. tooth and gem farm over there where the hound mounds are later in the game, okay? Right now, we need to get ourselves a good established base before winter so that we don't die to the deer clops like 90% of unprepared players do. Where is my bug now? 90% of unprepared players do that? Okay, maybe it's more like 98% of unprepared players. Ah! Anyway, I have been busy. I have gathered Ooh. charcoal for making us drying racks. I have gathered the materials, well, the more difficult materials for getting a bee box. I haven't got the boards because burning down trees or chopping them right in front of a tree guard is not a great way to harvest wood. Oh, let's murder these killer bees. And I got us two stingers for booster shots. I'm, I'm feeling like we're in a fairly good spot right now. Except that we need a whole lot more wood. Like, a crazy amount more wood. Should I start chopping? Um, coming back with a stack or two of wood would not be a bad thing at all. At all at all. It'll be one stack. And... Well, I ain't got room for two. Do I? Oh, no, I have a shovel. I am constantly losing things in my inventory in my old age. It's truly terrible. I imagine we're getting a pretty decent collection of redbird feathers, too, hey? Where? Ah! You evil thing! Who's ah, evil you thing? Ah, you lovely thing! Who are you? Lovely, are you, lovely thing. Are you talking to me? No. Not at the moment. Where's the lovely thing? I, Hello, I don't know what lovely thing you're talking thing. about. thing. Oh, you found Chester. Ah. Why didn't you just say so? Um, He's my adorable little Chester. Yeah, you, you found him. You can keep him. side of things, which is fortunate because I've got some stuff to salt him. Uh-huh. How, how is your sanity? My and are sanity? you coming back to base? Please come um, back to base. You know how many green mushrooms are around here. And I'll come back to base soon. 
I'm, I'm really wanting to end the episode, and it's kind of hard to do that without you here. Why? Because, I don't know, I guess we did it without you here before, but I feel like we've just been going in different directions, and I I'd prefer to end the episode together. I don't know. I do not have enough rot to make a second booster shot, but I am putting one in our chest. And I'm also going to make us some honey poultices, I think, because we have more reeds than we have room for at the moment. So... Where are all the mushrooms? Did you pick all of them? Um, no, I didn't pick all of them. There's a massive number of mushrooms near the Pig King, but there's also a dozen in our chest, so... Oh, it's two honey and one wild rat. I'll be getting more honey later, though. I guess I'll be running back home as fast as I can. That would probably be a good plan. But that was what I was encouraging you to do anyway. I might see you soon. Might? You have light, right? Please tell me you have light. Yes, I have light. Should I roast those mushrooms up for you right now? Um, let's see how many I would need... Four, five mushrooms would do good. I will roast them up and then they will be ready for you when you get here. Do you want any food in the crock pot? Food in the crock pot? Um, I don't think I need anything yet. You sure? How about a honey ham? No! Ooh, how much health does that heal? Lots. It heals I lots. Don't, I don't need that. It's something that heals health. My health is pretty much full. Oh, well, then we can save it for emergency. The mushrooms are in the fridge for you. Get your sanity up, please. Aw, Chester. Chester. Um, should I give Chester the pan flute? Or just hang on to it for the I'm moment? I'm not sure he can play it. <laughs> Fair enough. Fair enough. All right. Well, we're we've made good progress and had some adventures, but I think it's time to sign off. And um, you want to grab that honey ham and pop it in the fridge for later if you're not going to eat it. So much work. And what? then we'll say goodbye to our viewers and hope that they come back to join us next time as we continue to prepare for winter. Bye. Goodbye, everyone. Goodbye. Thanks for joining us and have a wonderful day.